You want to start off by having just your hair, as you can tell, is a mess right now. So take your brush and just comb through it. After you comb through your hair, you're just going to take a spray bottle like this. And this is just filled with pure water from a tap. And I'm just going to take it and I'm going to spray it kind of evenly just to dampen up my hair a little bit. But I'm not going to try to soak my hair or anything. Okay, so after you think that you that kind of like evenly distributed throughout your hair, you just want to take a wide tooth comb and just kind of brush through it a little bit. After your hair is slightly damp, I'm taking a little bit of this Surf Hair Texture Paste and it just looks like this. And I'm taking about that much and I'm just going to rub this between my fingers and run this through the ends of my hair. evenly distributing the product. Okay, so after it's in all of your ends, you wanna take about that much and rub it through your fingers and all over like your hands like this and take your fingers and go like comb back like this to get it like into your crown. So what you're going to be doing, it's not really a French braid and it's not just a normal braid. I'm gonna kinda of walk you through it as I do it. Okay, so you want to take the front section of your hair, like your bangs and just like the front hairs, and gather that into a small section, split it into three sections, and just start to braid like you would normally braid. Um, after you do that first set of braid, you just want to grab more hair from the side of your head and work that into your braid. So you're just like pulling more and more hair over as you're, I don't know if this is making sense, so just watch here. See, I'm taking this aside right there, and this just looks like a lot of hair to work with, and it's kind of messy because of the hairspray and stuff, but let's see. See, I'm just taking the hair from down under and joining it with the piece that I had already braided in. Okay, so now that your braid is all done, um, I just like to let mine sit for about like, um, in like an hour and a half, two hours. Now I'm just going to wait for this to kind of sink in, and I will see you guys when it's ready. I find that this works better if you don't sleep on it. Okay, so this is my favorite part when you get to take the braid out of your hair, and I've let this sit for about. An hour or so, maybe. So, if it's not wavy, then I'll just rebraid my hair. Oh, it's wavy. Okay. So you just get these really kind of loose, beachy looking waves. And they're actually really pretty. I really like them. I love wearing my hair wavy. I feel like you can only leave the braid in for a certain long, like if you were to sleep with the braid in, I think that'd be too long and the waves would just turn into like frizz. And that's not what anybody wants. Nobody wants like really frizzy hair. Okay, so this is how you get just this really fun, beachy, pretty hairstyle. And if you guys decide to try this out, um, tweet me pics or email me pics or um, just let me know how it went. So all my links and stuff are going to be in the bottom bar below. And I'll talk to you guys later. So after unbraiding my hair, I put it back into another braid and I let it sit for about an hour and a half longer and the curls came out a lot more kind of curly and fun so just keep that in mind when um, doing your hair.